Yo, yo, what up guys? If I look the same as I did in the last video, it's because it's the same day, same night. Um, whew, I'm exhausted, I'm starving, and uh, we're ready to get these freaking wheels on. So, I posted up about wanting some wheels on the car a while back, looking for ideas. Had a guy, semi, I wouldn't say local, like two, three hours north, said he was getting rid of these wheels, which just so happened to be the same wheels that I screenshotted and sent to Kaylin just a couple days prior. They were on a CTSV and they just look gorgeous. It's the way that they, with the brakes behind it and just absolutely gorgeous. I looked them up, I was like, I'm not, like to buy those and buy some decent tires on them, like I didn't really have the money. Lo and behold, this dude comments on my post, he said, I'm putting some wheels up for sale that you might like or whatever. I, I might even say what kind of wheel it was in the post. So I go and look, boom. These are the wheels I want. Now I'm not sure on the color. They, he had a white Golf R with these. You know, I got a white S3. They look great. I don't think he had red brakes though. So that's, that's where it really comes into play with me. I don't know if I like the red. The red could go to yellow or black or the wheels could go black. But either way, these wheels are nice very nice there's not many miles on them and the tires are practically brand new i got like msrp for all this i got it for like 40 percent off so i couldn't pass it up this is the most money i've ever spent on wheels in my life ever ever and i couldn't pass it up i like with the way that the body lines are on this car i was like i'm not just slapping some rpf ones or some hypergrams on it like i did with the golf i wanted something that matched and looked good and you see the eye flick like good so we're gonna find out. Here we are. The Titan TS5s, TSO5s. Man, this light really ruins it. Let me, uh, wow, I'm sorry, guys. This is my LED light, like, really destroyed. Huh? That's a little bit better. They're bronze. They're gorgeous. I think they're like 16 or so pounds for the 18s. They're a little dirty. This is one of the front tires. That was a front. I think this was a back tire. I mean, they look great they're forged wheels titan seven it should have oh ts5 boom right there get the right angle ts5 and he gave them to me with um centric spacers pilot sport 4s some some nice meat on them plenty of life on them so we're gonna go ahead and just toss these on you guys saw in one of the last videos where i went ahead and put the stud conversion on because I knew what was about to go down, so say goodbye to these ugly wheels, here we go. Y'all, these look way better than I expect them to, especially on the front. Oh my, I cannot wait, my car is filthy, the wheels are pretty dirty. We're going to come back tomorrow, it's supposed to rain all day tomorrow, so Tuesday, Probably gonna line the car after work and it's already dark by the time I get home. So Wednesday probably clean the car real good after work Try my best to at least know because Wednesday we're supposed to leave to go to Pennsylvania right after work See there's so much going on. So maybe I'll line the car tomorrow and then wash it Tuesday Man anyway check these bad boys out I know the color is way off because the LED light but man do they ever fit Man that looks so good. It is so much better in person, too. We are not seeing the same things, but... Golly. They look great. This is going to be good. This is going to be real good. Step back a little bit. Tilt the... Look at that. Shoo! Now, I definitely need to get some dimpled or uh, drilled rotors for the back to match the front or just some slotted for both. Either way, um... Damn, that looks good. I am very happy. Um, now, you can definitely tell these wheels offset more because they, these, the actual threads, sorry, pointed the wrong thing. The actual threads for these were sticking out more with the other wheels. So I'm hoping it sits rather flush. I mean, it looks like it is going to be pretty damn close. So we'll see. Um, I'm about to lower it. I'll put it on the ground, jack up the other side, do it. And I need to take the e-brake off so it'll settle. It doesn't sit right like after the e-brake's on and you jack it up. You guys know. I'm very excited. I had a call for the girlfriend. Tell her to come check this out. Alright, hopefully this portion doesn't look too dumb. 
Try and focus in. See what the stock wheel weighs. And I think these felt pretty light in hand for 19s in the OEM wheels. I guess would be 40 pounds. Can you guys even see the screen? Nope. Whoa, that was way off. 51.7. We'll try again. One more time. 51.7. All right. Let's grab a Titan. These are significantly lighter. No, 41.9. So, yeah. It's easily just about 10 pounds. Yeah, there we go. I will not argue with that at all. All right, y'all. Finally got the car clean. We're going to be able to see this thing in daylight. I'm going to pull it out, let you guys see it. And then we are going to take her M3 and my car out. We're going to go and try and find some place to get some pictures of the cars together. It's Thanksgiving Day. Uh, I decided not to go up to my parents because all the traffic and gas. I'm going to work tomorrow. So then we got to go back up for baby shower and this and that. Anyway, so it's Thanksgiving Day. We're going to go do this, take the dogs to the beach after that, and then cook up a nice fat ham. So let's see how the car looks in the daylight. She's nice and clean. I did put like 30 miles on it since it got washed. There might be a little bit of brake dust on it, but. Sheesh. Let's get him outside. All right, boys, here we go. It's a little in the shade. I'll get some better spots here and I'll put some pictures up, but man, it looks good. Really good. Now, now it makes my car look not as low. I'll wait for Danny to say something again. I mean, can't even get, I mean, it's decent. I would like a little bit lower. I'd like, you know, the fender to be like right here on this line, like front and back. Maybe, uh, maybe not that high or that low, I mean, but. Either way, a little bit lower eventually. You know, car's still brand new. We got loads of things to do in time. But yeah, she's looking gorgeous. She's got the DSLR and the M3. We're gonna go try and find some spots for pictures and stuff. I don't know how well it's gonna go. And I wanna do some more like zero to 60 and eighth mile pulls now that the sway bar and links, the wheels are on, different tires and all that. See if it makes a difference at all. And in here, probably the next not next weekend but the weekend after that I'll probably put the Verkline arms on and then do it again and by then it's gonna be halfway through freaking December <laughs> so I will only do one more clip in this video and then I'll start a video with just us messing around you guys will see that another time so let's get the cracking we out here just warm enough to have the sunroof open about what does that say 58 degrees Got the M3 out she, she usually takes off in this thing Taking it slow this time. Wait for it. <laughs> She's funny. I don't know if you guys can hear that. The intake with a little bit of. Whoosh. Just a little bit. Sounds good. Hopefully we can find a decent spot for pictures. Hopefully we can find a spot along here somewhere. We walked here before, we never brought our cars here. Looks like that's like a walking lane or a bike lane over there, so maybe somewhere down here we can we can pull in and get some pictures or something. The sun's facing the right way too, so this will be nice. Well, we didn't find the best spots, but we did find some good spots. Um, if we had a little bit more daylight, the sun's right about to go over the trees, so it just sucks daylight savings time and shit, but there you go. In the sunlight, boom. I think she got some pretty stellar pictures. Hopefully we can edit out this, uh, this pole here, but uh, looking real good. Get out of the sun here. Looking good. Makes me happy. Looks great. And I'll see if I can get her into a race. You wanna do a 30 roll? <laughs> mm. Looks kinda of dumb on this side with the... Oh. It's good. 
should turn your, your tail lights on. Man, I'm happy. All right, well, we gotta get back, get the dog to the beach where the sun goes down, and then start cooking for Thanksgiving. Not much, just us. Some ham, some stuffing and stuff, but very productive uh, Thanksgiving. Got our daughter's room pretty much all together, a bunch of stuff built, organized. It's a good day, so. Hope you guys like this video. Let me know what you guys think about the wheels. I know the car needs to be a little bit lower, and I don't know if I want to powder coat them black, or get the calipers black, or calipers yellow, and leave them gold, or calipers black, or wheels black, calipers yellow. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. For now, we're gonna rock it, and uh, a couple things I need to order still. Next week, we'll have that uh, EQT grounding kit in, and the trailing arms and then hopefully next weekend we can get that muffler delete done i'll be down in virginia beach working so we'll see thanks for watching i'll catch you in a flip-flop